Hello everybody, this is Adam here for A-Strings and in today's video we are taking a look at the brand new Dunlop Justin Chancellor Wah. Now I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Justin Chancellor, bassist from Tool, this pedal must be a bass pedal. It is a bass pedal, on paper it's a bass pedal, but we are going to try this pedal with a standard electric guitar and a baritone electric guitar just to see what kind of sounds we get. So from a guitarist's point of view, what sounds can we get from what should be a bass pedal? Now, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the pedal and some features. I'll tell you about the chain, and then we'll make some noise. Does that sound good, Tom? Sounds good, sounds good. So, let's keep it nice and simple. This is obviously our wah treadle, and it is spring-loaded, much like the Crybaby bass from Dunlop. Um, so it resets once you've used it. Bam, bam. Uh, this little knob at the bottom here, this sets how long the delay is between the effect coming on and going off, essentially. So when you release the pedal, uh, we've set it all the way on so it's quick. So as soon as I come off the pedal, the effect is off. Obviously, you can set it all the way the other way or in between, and the effect will kind of sit for a second or two uh, before it goes off to your, your bypass signal then. As you can see on the side, we've got our selection for the fuzz. Now, we've got our fuzz on and off switch here, but also we've got our little kick switch on the side, which allows the fuzz to be on even when the wire is off. So when this is on, the fuzz comes on with the wah, and when this is in, our fuzz is on with and without the wah being engaged. We've got our amount of fuzz, tone and volume, simple, simple, you know what that's all about. And then we've got some controls for our wah. Now, this is to select which version of the wah we want. We've got two options. We've got the standard style wah, which is based on a modified crybaby. We've got our volume and our Q select, that's our sweep sort of select. And UK filter. Now this one is a little bit more like an envelope filter. Think of the Dunlop bass wah, where it's an envelope filter type pedal. That's what we're getting here. Same thing, volume and a Q sweep. And it just gives us something a little bit different. It's a little bit more kind of synthy sounding. And it's, it's awesome. You'll hear some clips uh, in a bit, uh, but we think they sound great. And that's pretty much it. Uh, it can run off of 9 volt batteries or power supply. Easy peasy. And that's all you need to know. We've tried to get some clean wah sounds with both style wahs. The fuzz on its own with a few different options of how much gain. We've kept the volume and tone neutral for the fuzz. Um, just for ease of the video, otherwise it would have taken hours and hours for you to sit through us turning knobs and turning knobs and turning knobs. So, nice and easy with that one. So that's it, we've given you fuzz from as subtle to as crazy as it'll go, and let's talk about our chain. So, our chain for today is either my Strat, that's an American special Stratocaster with bare knuckles, uh, they're the Irish Tour bare knuckles, if anyone is interested, um, for tonal purposes, as if you care. And baritone-wise, we are using the Squire Paranormal Cabernet Baritone Telecaster. Very, very cool. Awesome sounding. We've done all the audio recording already, and it's probably my favourite pedal to come out in a long, long time. It's so cool. Into the pedal. Into really, really simple. It's a Fender Blues Junior. Would you expect it? No, probably not. We wanted to take something that wasn't rocky or wasn't down the path that you'd expect it to be, you know, like your, your Marshalls or your Black Stars or your Messes or that kind of thing, or Orange. That would have been a good one. Uh, we wanted to see what it sounds like with something completely uh, not neutral, it's not the word, but. We wanted to see what it'd sound like with something that you wouldn't expect then. Let's say that. Let's just say that. Mic'd up with an SM57 into our recorder and straight to you. So here we go. 
here's some sounds. Uh, we've tried to film as best we can and uh, enjoy.
that is it. That is the brand new. I'll get it. I'll get it in my hands as I'm talking about it. This is the brand new Justin Chancellor Wah. You can use this for bass, and you can use this for guitar, and you can use this for baritone, and you could probably use it for other things as well that we can't think of. We wanted to give you something different because every video that's out there at the moment and will probably come will have this running through bass. And that's fair enough. It is a bass pedal. But as you can hear in this video, it sounds unbelievable. I would use this. I would use this with a guitar or a baritone. No question whatsoever. It sounds amazing. The fuzz is awesome. And that is it. The proof is in the pudding. Can we get pudding now? That is it. I've been Adam for A-Strings. We are a small music shop in South Wales in the UK. astrings.co.uk is the website name. I'm clicking the buttons as I'm talking. I realise this. Uh, we're on Instagram. We're on Facebook. And we are here, of course. You found us. Hello. Uh, like and subscribe the, to the video if you like the video and you'd like to subscribe. Do both those things, please. We'd love you to join. If you're already joined, thank you for being a part of the family. Uh, we love you. We'll see you in the next video very, very soon. Bye-bye.